Even though the solar eclipse of 2017 has come and gone, the memory will remain for many of our students and teachers in the Cherokee County School District. For them to understand how rare this is and to be a part of it and for them to get excited, this springboards them into wanting to know more about our natural world. So you start to broaden their interest, their passion, just from maybe one type of phenomena may lead them down a path of discovery. Here's how some of our students studied the event. Aside from watching the eclipse on NASA TV, Clark Creek Elementary second graders learned about the basic mechanics of the eclipse and made paper models of the sun and the moon. Fourth graders pondered how our small moon could block out something as large as the sun, while kindergartners learned some basic observational skills with a Pop Rocks treat. Across town at Teasley Middle School, sixth graders enjoyed an outdoor party in the shrouded sunlight. Since it's part of our sixth grade curriculum to learn about solar eclipses, we ordered solar glasses in May and set up this whole event so that our kids could actually experience a solar eclipse instead of just learning about it from a book. Students worked in teams to record temperature readings that they shared with NASA while observing the celestial phenomenon. But the place to be was 90 miles away at Tallulah Gorge State Park with Virginia Sang's Cherokee High School astronomy class who observed their surrounding environment in near darkness. One of the best parts of all, I think, truly was the students' reaction because we'd been talking about it leading up to the eclipse in class, but it was something very different. I don't know, so many of them were just blown out of the water in the moments thereof and afterwards they're like, it was unlike anything I, I ever expected, so many of them were just, um, just given the memory of a lifetime. And I just am so proud and thrilled to have been any part of it.